Hi, I'm Deborah and Skating Sisters. Happy New Year. So I'm actually on holidays at the moment, hence hair up, lovely dress on. But we have been waiting for these two boxes for a very long time. And so when Janine texted me a photo of them, still unpacked, I had to just, I was just like, I'm on my way. And I'm straight here. <laughs> and I've got my scalpel in hand and I had to show you guys as well. We've not seen this yarn before. It's super special. We've been waiting for it for several weeks and it got stuck in customs or else you would have all had your hands on it before Christmas. So, let's, let's go. go with them let's and go, let's see. Go. <laughs> Which one first? This one. Okay, we'll try this one first. All right, so there's a number of different yarns. There are. And obviously, we don't know what's bases. been packed. Different bases. Yes. All from uh, the same. Same. <gasps> company which is called knitting for olive yay Yay! we're so excited about this yeah so yes we've got four bases i think it is yep and this is the merino one so let's just open this up um it's a four ply pretty most of their yards are actually four ply and oh, it's a non-superwash merino it's really, you go, you can, oh. you feel it too, Janine. Oh boy, it's, got, it's really lovely. It's really lovely. It's got, um, it's really lovely. so 100% extra fine merino, traceable, non-mules. It ticks all of those boxes, not super wash, um, 50 grams, 250 meters. And so a lot of their patterns, and they have the most divine patterns, beautiful kids clothes that's really where they started off with their designing yeah, yeah. and then they've um, gone into adults clothes as well a lot of them are with um, four ply and then a lot of them are done in eight ply weight because they're going to wait here's some we prepared <laughs> earlier we <laughs> had this box so long ago we've just been waiting for the so, rest of it <clears throat> so the second base Ooh. is the soft silk mohair so the eight ply, you could do the mohair together with it, mm. or you could do two strands of this. This is honestly, this is really lovely. It just really, really feels lovely. Feels beautiful. Our staff are a bit excited. Yeah. Hopefully, there's some left. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So and let's do some digging. Look, All right. Look at the colours. Um, I was better tell you what this colour. This one's called putty. The one that we were looking at. Oh, beautiful green. The palette is a. Is Absolutely a, amazing. Very much a Scandinavian influenced palette. Very yeah, soft. Very beautiful colours. And of course, all of their bases work so across, with the others. So the colours yeah. go across the different all of bases. So when you if you want to combine a like with a like, you can. But you can also put Oh hello. Sorry, I'm just I'm just talking. <laughs> <She's a dog. laughs> uh, you can um, but you can also chop and change them. So yeah. anyway, hey, look at these. Look at that. So gorgeous. This mm. one is, 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 is artichoke purple. Mm -hmm. And this one is camel rose. Okay. So oh, right. oh, we got another base. Base number three is this one called pure silk. So again, a four ply. And. Oh, very pretty. Look at that. <clears throat> it is. Oh, it's mm, amazing. So 100%. Burette silk, again, 250 meters, 50 grams, on a gauge of about 28 stitches for um, 10 centimeters. And Janine, you can feel yeah, that one what too. What is this color? So, um, this one is Dusty, Dusty Artichoke, Artichoke, which I'm looking on Ravelry, this is the most popular color. It's, it's just, it's really it's soft so too. beautiful. Wow. Um, so there's absolutely gorgeous little um, singlet tops and yeah. things like that, all for this pure silk. It's very, very lovely. Uh, the thing that we really loved about their story was a, it's a mother and daughter who started the business but also their um, their ethics around their yarn production so they're very careful about where they get their back their, um, their fiber from the type of mill that they're using and so on so it just it ticks so many boxes for us as well and we thought it was just a really great fit for our store um, yeah can't wait to pass on, but there is one more. There is yes, one more. Let's open this box and see. There's lots of colours in their full range. Absolutely um, tons. It's tons like and tons. A hundred or something. So 
We, we couldn't are, get them all. No, but we've got a, a nice, a really lovely Reunion. cross section of different colors. Oh my God, look at that pink. Of that one. colors. Um, and then obviously we can, we can order more. Yeah, always order more. Okay. Oh, oh my goodness. So pretty, but there's brights in there as well. It's not just yeah, um, no, not just like like no, that is gorgeous yeah, color. That is that. Um, burnt orange. Hmm. Hmm. Can you find, Can I find that other base, the other base, the final base that of the four? Not in that one. Oh, of course, <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you a hint. It's a oh, blend. It is a blend. Ta-da! Okay, and what is it, Deb? It is cotton merino. Yay! And how much cotton and Let's how much see. merino? Oh, that's soft. So 70% organic cotton and 30% merino. Again, it's the non-superwash, non-mules, traceable, all of that lovely, lovely stuff. And it's got, it's soft, but it's got that cottony feel too. But I can tell, I know when they were designing this one, they were mm, wanting to have just enough wool to give you some elasticity when yeah. you're actually knitting. Yeah. So that it's not that string-like feel that you sometimes get from cotton and that people don't like if they're knitting cotton. But this has just got some softness and bounce to it as well. Um, and it is deliciously soft. It's deliciously soft. If you want to know more about them, fruit, they've just been on Fruity Knitting on their podcast and it's absolutely fascinating. So I really recommend that you go and watch yeah. that episode too we learned a whole heap and they showcase about some of their designs too so you get to yeah. see the, the the thought process behind some of the designs but also um, exactly. how they translate from from the children's to adult versions and ooh. Mm. gosh deep petroleum blue that is pretty that is sometimes pretty. it's a bit hard to see with the plastic over the top but trust us they are really pretty yeah so, so oh my goodness We'd better rush so to get them in the store. <laughs> <laughs> They'll all be online now. 